This is Holland Gallagher. And this is Fonte Coleman. And we met uh, at the Uber line at LAX. Bam. Okay. <laughs> that really happened. Story? <laughs> you know, I would always say that North Carolina was the fourth member of Little Brother. Just in the sense that we never, we couldn't have made the music we made anywhere else. You know, if we were living in Brooklyn or LA or wherever, you know, we still could have made records, but I just don't think they would have had the same amount of honesty um, that was there from living here. And um, just the thing about living in the South, you know, particularly here, is just that, you know, you have time to, to think. You know, you walk outside and you see trees and birds, <laughs> and you know, there, there's a sense of, of stillness that's there. And I think that's really important for an artist. Um, I really think you have to have those moments of just reflection and you, you spend a lot of time in your head. And um, I think that's hard to do in a bigger city. I think, I think that would be kind of difficult. And so um, for me, you know, once we started, you know, traveling and going all these other places, you know, I had the opportunity like to see LA, to see New York, to see Tokyo, wherever, you know what I mean? And none of those places were exciting enough for me to want to leave home. You know, there, there was nothing I saw in any of those other places that was like, oh man, I got to move to here or I got to move here. Um, if you got talent and Wi-Fi, you can make it from anywhere. And so North Carolina is home and you know, that's just what it is. And that is woven into the fabric of all the music that I create. And so this is where I'm at, this is where I'm gonna stay. Yeah, that's what it is. It's the same thing for Hype where now that you do have the resources to do stuff on your own, for me it was about like looking at the community that I was living in as like the first step of making uh, my show, which is about to me, stuff that's happening in Durham right now. From where I was positioned, it was about like startups because I was working at uh, Runaway. Shout out to Runaway. And also producing music. Um, but yeah, if, if I had moved to LA, you know, I can't just like go to the coffee shop and ask to shoot there because they would be like. That's a whole nother thing. Like, That's no. a production. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm <laughs> right. saying? So, logistically, specifically for film, shooting in your community and using the resources that you have and like cashing in on the social cachet that you have with your relationships, not in like a cynical way, but like in a, I think that you're hotel is cool, can I come like put it in my show? And people generally in Durham so far have been like, yes. Using it as a way to elevate your community, not like use your community, but elevate your community and, and talk about what you're living is something you can do now.